emergency broadcast. We're sorry. All circuits are busy now. Will you please try your call again later? Hello YouTube and Preppers, this is the Comms Prepper with a video about TNCX modems. Uh, today I've got them set up in two vehicles and we're going to do data file transfers between two cars using an FT60 Yesu radio and the Ocean radio using the TNCX modem connected to two laptop computers and we're going to transfer files and communicate digitally between two cars. I have the setup here in the minivan, the PC is connected to the TNCX, which is connected to the Yesu radio, which I have connected to an external antenna, which is on the roof. And we're going to be communicating with my Honda Insight over there. I have a, another TNCX in that vehicle with the Ocean handheld radio connected to the bug out bag laptop computer. So we're going to communicate between these two cars and over there I have a camera sitting on the front seat so hopefully I can do a split screen and you can see the action take place in both vehicles. So the first test we're going to do here is just a simple connection test. So I'm going to hit, go ahead and hit start here and those two radios should start communicating with each other. And now we have a link. You can see it take a place in the software there. And since there was no traffic for either station, they'll disconnect. And that's where it says they're disconnected. So what I did here is in the draft items, I have the preamble to the United States Constitution, which I'm going to transmit from the minivan here, post to outbox as a peer-to-peer -peer message, to my Honda. So we'll go ahead and open up the session again, and we'll start another connection. We'll hit start and get those two radios linked up. And this computer is now reporting this message traffic for the other station. And that green bar represents that message being sent. It's completed. And the two stations disconnected. So we just transmitted the preamble to the U.S. Constitution from one vehicle to another. And if somebody were monitoring this channel or this frequency, all they would be hearing are those tones. And if they didn't have a packet motor themselves, those tones would make no sense to them. But you're getting 100% error-free communications with the packet modem. If there's any errors, the modems will request the a resend of that last packet to make sure that connection is perfect. So here's another option for your emergency communications planning and your preps. If you're looking for a way of simple but accurate communications between two locations that can be separated as far as your radios can communicate for emergency communications. And as always, thank you for watching my videos and subscribing to my channel. This has been the Comms Prepper with a follow-up video to the TNCX packet modem made by Coastal Chipworks with the Yesu FT60 radio and the Ocean radio.